New information tonight about a deadly shooting from over the weekend. Police telling us they arrested a 13 year old suspect. The teen is accused of shooting and killing Mohammed Pazir. Officials say it happened while the suspect was trying to steal a car. The victim tried to stop him and was shot. The suspect now facing capital murder charges. Now that teen isn't the only one arrested for gun violence this month. Just last week, another 13 year old was arrested in connection to a shooting at a West Side apartment complex. As Fox SA's Stephanie Esquivel reports, despite these arrests, violent team crimes are actually on the decline right now. I know if you if you speak to law enforcement officers who are in the community on the ground working, they're going to tell you that they're feeling a lot more um, that there's a lot more violent crime activity by both adults and young people. Chief Juvenile Probation Officer for Bear County, Jill Mata, says recent shootings have put a spotlight on teens and gun violence. And as we got out of COVID and um, things started happening again, the, the rates have come up. So those rates are, uh, you know, that we've been seeing them creep up since that time. During the pandemic, teen crime rates plummeted. Even though they're on the rise again, they're still not as high as they were in 2019. From this time last year, it's down 8%. So if you do a whole full year look back, you don't see a trend up. Benny Price, program director at the Gang Rehabilitation Ending Affiliation Ties program, says he's working with his team in hopes to keep these crime rate statistics dropping. Well, um, they're not necessarily going to say um, why they're getting involved, but we know that it's a culture, it's a gun violence culture that they've been a part of. Um, and we think that um, one of the biggest problems is there's not enough... Um, youth programs for these kids. Price says his team targets kids who may already be around gun violence. We have credible messages that goes out into the neighborhoods to build a relationship um, with, with the neighborhoods and residents and those who are known to be um, shooters or uh, carry guns uh, and being gun violence. Teens cannot legally purchase guns. Mata and Price say gun owners can be part of the solution by making sure their firearms are always safely stored and out of reach to minors. Stephanie Esquivel for Fox SA.